Mario and friends headed to the Space Bypass in search for the Pure Heart. How did Squirps know about this secret route? Our hero started suspic stared suspiciously at him. Why are you staring like that? It said Squirps. Are you falling for Squirps? In the darkness of space, the eyes of Squirps glinted in mischievously. Uh, that's not a good thought. Anyways, hey guys, it's Snag Transfer here, bringing you more Super Paper Mario with Chapter 4-3, The Gates of Space. Okay, so we're back in space. Oh, I'm not looking forward to this from that last episode. Ooh. This is the Space Bypass. Yeah, from somewhere in here, we can enter the Woe Zone. What? What? The Woe Zone? You simply must be kidding me with me. I demand answers. It's a prohibited zone, Scorps call it the Space Graveyard Squeaks. It's complicated maze. They say once you go in, you can never get out. And supposedly, the pure heart is hidden at the very back of the maze. Squeaky! How would you know that? Who are you really, you incontinent little imp? He's hungry, that's who he is. Squirple Squirp! I made some room with that pit stop, now I'm hungry. Don't worry about that, Space Grunt. Find the low zone entrance, Squibble. Don't call me Space Grunt! I am your captain! Obey me! Ugh! Jeez. I'm in charge of you, not vice versa, you little sweet. Gonna use you as a gun! Jeez. Okay, anyways, we're now in Chapter 4-3 here, and we're gonna get some items over here. Back to playing more Arcadia or Galaga or whatever the hell this is. <laughs> so yeah, there's a, here's a new mechanic. When you touch these things, they bounce you back and they actually give you damage. So you want to avoid these at all costs. Uh, I just keep shooting like randomly because I can. You know, if they give you unlimited ando ammo, why not? <laughs> I mean, seriously, kind of like Metroid Prime or Hunters, whatever the hell. Okay, why did that mushroom fall? That doesn't really make any sense. Like, even, I know I hit it out of a block, but why did it fall? I mean, there's no gravity in space. There's no there's no air in space. What the heck? I don't think it could fall, too. I mean, seriously, it just float on forever for no reason. Uh, is there anything in third dimension when I flip? Check it out. No? Huh. And I cannot hit that block because Mario cannot go up when he's in third dimension. Don't know why. Really big disappointment for me. Okay, there's a red X. We have to go defeat him with, uh, Robin. Or Fleep. And what the... Oh, look! Sprite doors! Awesome! Yeah, this hole just happens to be shaped like Swerps. Yeah, no. Yeah, that totally makes sense. Squirrel Squawk! This hole! What a lovely shape, Squirrel! I don't know why, but I want to be squeezed in there. Someone squish me in. Want to squeeze Squirps in there? Yeah, you deserve it. Squizzard. Um, how did you do that? What is this thing? If I knew, I'd tell you. This is a space gate, Squirp. These lead to space bypass the whole wool zone. Through these gates is the way forward, space grunts. I am your captain. Stop calling me a space grunt. Mario may be okay with it, but I'm not. I'm sorry. It's not cool, man. Not cool. Okay, so we're going to the woe zone through those interdimensional ga space gates that apparently he was talking about. So that's the whole theme around this area right here. Um, let's see what else we can do. There's a sign in space. Wow. Oh, chosen one. What will fulfill this strange alien's desire? Something with the... Sweet, that starts with Cho and ends with Let. This will open the way. Chocolate. Yeah, that was such a hard puzzle to figure out. Ugh. Okay. So I kind of went, I kind of did something different from what you're supposed to do, but I'm going to make this a lot easier for you guys. So uh, we're going to go through that portal right there like we already did and just keep going through this place. Now, the thing about this, uh, let's, I don't know, get rid of the stopwatch, I don't care about the thing. Uh, the thing about this area is you're supposed to find chocolate. And, uh, there's a convenience store out here somewhere in space. Things in space! And this is the portal that you want to go through. There's a couple, quite a few portals that actually lead you to the wrong places, but this is the one that you want to go through, okay? 
Trust me on with this, okay? Trust me. You don't want to flip with, um, flip on that red mark that we actually saw before, because, uh, you'd pretty much be screwing yourself out of stuff. Uh, is there anything behind these? Anything at all? Game, that is lame, dude. There's just happens to be a shop out here in the middle of space. What the heck, dude? Have a twinkly day. Welcome to Twinkle Mart. If we're not closed, we're open. Whoa, I was so lonely since our grand opening. You're our first customer. I think I should have thought about location more when I bought this place. Yeah, I think so too, pal. What you looking for today? Just grab whatever grabs your eye, Twinkle Shoppers. Okay, so let's give you a Shroom Choco Bar. 50 uh, coins. And yeah, that tickles my fancy, I guess. Have a twinkly day. Okay, and we're gonna leave. Now the thing... No, I don't want to go back in the store. Jeez, I wanted to... No, I don't want anything, dude. Dude! This looks like a... 7 up. If you heard that sound, that was me face palming. Okay. Go to the right, to the right, to the right, then go up, to the up, to the up. And just shoot this thing and get a whole bunch of coins right here. Holy crap. I just got a whole bunch of coins. Jeez. Okay. And that shop is almost flat. Yeah, for some reason, I don't know. It actually has a plat platform to actually go there. That's weird. How much did you invest in that place, dude? Because, oh my god, you, you made the worst investment of your life. Oh my god. Okay. Now that we've gone through there, we can now head back to that sleep sign, which is over here. I'll actually point it out. I'll go to it and stuff. Uh, you can go into any of the uh, other places, but this—that was the one that you do want to go to, because otherwise, you're gonna be ending. You're gonna end up going in the wrong place. I believe it is this one that you want to go to. Yeah, the purple one is the one returning you back to the place. The blue ones are going to different places. So that's how you remember how to go back. Okay. So now that we've gone over there and gotten a chocolate bar because I was very hungry. We're now going to flip the red X with our Robin. And we have another door. Secret door, secret door, secret door, secret door. No. Scorpel, scorpel, squee! Another wonderful shape. I feel another compulsion must get twisted into there. Someone twist me in. Want to twist Scorpels in there? Yes. He must pay for making me a so called space grunt. Um... Something's missing, Squirt. Definitely. I can't shake it. There's only one solution. That's right. Squirps must eat something yummy. Squirps will not move until Squirps eat something good. This I declare. Squirp! Okay. So what you gotta do now is just give him that chocolate bar that he likes so much. And... I did not get a chocolate bar. I'll be right back. I guess me continuously going in there was fate telling me that, hey, idiot, you didn't even get the freaking chocolate bar. You're so, you're stupid. Oh, Squirps, I'm back with your freaking chocolate bar that I hate you so much for having to go get again. Squirps, so hungry. Squirps can't move. Well, Squirps can move, but very slowly. Squirps need something yummy. Give him the chocolate. Take it. Scarf is gourmet. You'd think I'd be satisfied by something like this, Squag. But you went through all this trouble, Space Grunt, so I don't want to, but... Squatchum! This... Th this is... Rich chocolate fun and fungus texture are the war in this mouth, and Squirps loves it! The ultimate snack battle. Chocolate battle of justice! Wait, mushrooms and chocolate. That sounds awful. Squo Squirgle! Too good! It doesn't matter what chocolate bar you actually get him, as long as you just get one of them. But, uh, what he says actually changes depending on what bar you give him, though. Squirp, sorry about that. Squirp's got carried away. Yeah, you think? The gate. It appeared. Yes, once again, uh, Tippy, Captain Oblivious, we already know that. Let's go through the gates to space. We're going to space camp. Whee! Okay. 
And there's some more enemies over here. Gonna have to play Galaga again. Okay. Let's see if we can avoid them. Oh, look, the end of the chapter box is right there. The fig. Okay. Uh, are they still here? No. They left. What the heck? I was going to destroy some space aliens, but no. They decided, hey, I don't want to be destroyed. Be smart about it. Ugh, whatever. Oh, well. Anyways, that completes this chapter of Super Paper Mario. So if you like this part, please subscribe, favorite, like, or just comment. So I'll see you guys next time for more Super Paper Mario. Later.